Hey there, Northeast Kansas. Local time is 645, and that means it's time to talk some weather. Here's our day planner forecast. Just going to be one of those days. Temperatures this morning in the 30s and 40s. And the catch? Well, we keep temperatures in the 40s most of today. By lunchtime, 44. Cloudy and breezy. Those north winds about 10 to 20 miles per hour. Not a windy day, but enough of a bite from that north wind to make things feel even colder. Yes, wind chills this afternoon in the 30s and 40s. 49 degrees is my forecasted high for Topeka. Maybe 50 or 51 across some of our western communities, but still, it will feel even colder because of those north winds. Max track radar hanging out across the south towns this morning. Anywhere you see that green color on the screen, just some scattered light rain between Emporia and Olpe, even farther to the south and west into Strong City and Cottonwood Falls in Chase County, but then also south and east. Burlington south on Highway 75 there in Coffee County, a scattered shower just to the south and east of the city. Waverly, Osage City, Linden still seeing some scattered showers, but most of the organized rain missing us by a couple hundred miles to the south and east, bringing flooding concerns to southeast Kansas, but also central and eastern uh, Missouri. Cities like St. Louis uh, under the gun for about four inches of rain later today. For us, though, maybe just a chance for some scattered light rain or or some drizzle as we try to dry things out later today heading into tomorrow. Temperatures this morning cooler uh, farther north and west. 37 degrees is the cool spots in Marshall County this morning. 42 in Topeka, Linden and Lawrence. 41 degrees at K-State and Emporia. By this afternoon, future track trying to get 50 or 51 degrees into the forecast. But again, if we do that across the Flint Hills, it will still feel like about 45 degrees with these guys, the north winds. North winds today, 10 to 20 miles per hour. A bit lighter this morning along the Kaw River, but some of these winds can be gusting maybe 25 to 30 miles per hour this afternoon. And that's it. Wrapping things up in a forecast for you today from KSNT Storm Track Weather. Topeka, 49 degrees. By far the coldest day of the week. We are cloudy and damp. Maybe pack the rain gear just in case with the areas of drizzle possible on into the afternoon. Tonight, we fall back down to 34. We dry it out and we clear things out too. That means a chance for frost tomorrow morning outside of town. But don't worry, temperatures bounce back Wednesday afternoon. That's tomorrow, 64 and sunny. Still my pick of the week. Another cold front scheduled on Thursday. Uh, increasing clouds bring us a chance for some rain, and a couple computer models have that S word returning to the forecast too. If the cold air can catch up to the raindrops Thursday night, it could actually start to mix in some wet snow. Now, I've made some adjustments to your Easter weekend. Here's your way too early look at your planner forecast. By Good Friday, should be pretty nice. Lots of sunshine, 64 degrees. Saturday, a 20 or 30 percent chance for some isolated showers. Cooler, 54. That's another cold front, and that means temperatures in the 20s for Easter Sunday morning with a high trapped in the 40s again. So if you are headed out to any Easter services or heading over to some family or friends' houses or doing an Easter egg hunts, you want to bundle up for Easter Sunday.